Today I'm going to show you guys how to import and set up the point cloud in Revit. First thing you want to do is start a new project. Go to manage bar at the top, click manage link, point cloud. Uh, we typically use uh, the RCS file for our point clouds. You want to link it origin to internal origin. Get the point cloud in between uh, the elevation markers. First thing you want to do is, is rotate the point cloud is orthogonal with each of the elevations. Uh, so you can use the rotate tool, click the center of rotation button, and then you want to find a corner in a straight line uh, where you can determine the angle uh, that the point cloud is lying in its coordinate system. Once the point cloud is laid out orthogonally, you can start to set up your levels. The best way to do that is to cut a section down the middle of the property point cloud has been taken off. And this allows you to see each level's floor very clearly. You want to set up the levels to line up with each floor that uh, it is associated with. Level one, you want to keep at zero foot, zero inches, and then you know, adjust the other levels accordingly. And you can move that uh, section tool around to get some different views. Um, so for example, to set up the level of the roof, uh, you can get uh, an angle where the scanner was able to uh, visually see the, the exterior walls of the building and, and set it at the level up there. Once these levels are set up, you can see your plan views and notice that they are uh, an exact outline of, of what your floor plan would be. We use this data to manually draft each of these plan views and then combine it into uh, the 3D model. All right, and we're clear.